On this page, I have two sections. The top one here, which people can see when they want to download their bonuses. And on the bottom here, it's a message to ask them to log in to access their bonuses. So what I'm gonna do in this video is to show you how I can show this message to anyone that's logged in and the other one to members that are not logged in using conditional logic in Divi. Let me show you how. All right, so what we're gonna do now is we're going to come over here to this section and then click here on settings. Next, we're gonna come over here to advanced, click on conditions. So we want this to show up when users are logged in. So we need to click here on this plus button and then let's look for logged in. So here we are, logged in status. So I'm gonna say select and then I'm gonna say only display if user is logged in. We don't have to let, we don't have to add a label here. So we're gonna leave that as it is. And I'm gonna label the condition. I'm gonna now say save. And then I'm gonna save one more time. Next, I'm gonna come over here to this bottom here. Now this one here needs to show up when members or users are not logged in. So we can ask them to log in to access their bonuses. Okay, next, so I'm gonna come over here again, like what we did before. We're gonna click on this gear icon, advanced conditions. And then we're gonna click on this plus button. And again, we're gonna look for logged in status. So this time we want this to show up for logged out users. So I'm gonna select that and then save. Again, it's gonna ask us if we have a caching plugin. Now, if we do have that, we need to make sure that we deactivate that from this page or exclude it from this page. Next, we're gonna hit save. Excellent, so now let's save the page. And this time we're gonna exit the visual builder and see what happens. So if this is working, we need to be able to see this message here and not the bottom one. So I'm gonna exit the visual builder here. And sure enough, we are seeing this message here because I am logged into my website. Now, let me log out and see what happens. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on log out. So here's our page. Now it's asking us to log in. So these are the sort of things that you can do with Divi out of the box. It's very, very powerful. And you can imagine what you can use this for. Now, for those of you who haven't signed up for Divi yet, if you do using my affiliate link, I'll give you access to my web design formula course, a course that teaches you how to design professional looking websites with Divi. The link to that is in the video description below. All right, see you in the next tip. Take care.